Hey, hey, hey! Hey, hey, hey! I got life in all of the positivities that she needs. Wow in actual. Wow in actual. Back in this thing. Like a neighbor. Like a goat and chicken and a cow. Ah! What does that mean? I don't know. <laughs> but we finna rile. <laughs> I don't I don't know what that means. Corral like but just rile like. So oh, good. I know what you're saying, bro. I think. We just gonna either way we gonna stop. We gonna yeah. Well, man, nah, that's old. I ain't saying that. The profile, nah, nah, that's good. Why wow, we can profile? <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. 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 Yeah, you right. But that's why you love me though. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Ooh, but you still got here. Bars. <laughs> she got bars, guys. Okay? Blue face, baby. No, chill out. Woo. Chill out. That's mine. Blueface. But you can go ahead and preview it if you want. No, I'm fine. Alright. Freaking blue face, man. What you got? Wow. 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 So this so bro supposedly uh went into a jewelry store. Went into a jewelry store. I'm gonna try to be, you know, hotel. You feel me? My brother hotel. Bro. Okay. Alright. All but um he went into a jewelry store and he uh, he asked them specifically if he could get uh, the George Floyd uh, discount, like, like, and that's just like, oh, that's crazy. You laughing? Though. I'm laughing because it's sad. <laughs> it ain't because <laughs> that's hilariously sad. Like this nigga saying, because niggas dying, I deserve to get what I want for free. That's not. I, I don't like to. It might be a joke. It could be. It could be a joke. But he could be serious. I don't know. I don't like it. I don't know. We're talking about. We're talking about somebody who, at a point in time not too long ago, his way of donating was him standing on top of his uh, fucking rich ass nigga car and shit. I don't know what type of car it was. I don't remember the video, but I seen it and shit. He was standing on top of the car, just throwing out money onto the ground for homeless people to pick up. Wow. Like yeah, it's like like it's a strip club. Wow. Yeah, uh, bro. Uh, so we talking uh, about that. We talking about that guy. I don't know, man. I don't know. He he. Hmm. Cause you. Yeah. What do you mean? Yeah. 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 He always do types of. He always do shit like that. Bro. I don't know. I, I mean, feel like it's, it's just like some people think at certain moments and they be like, oh, it's the perfect time to cloud chase or something. Shit like that or something. Bro, and but this is the thing. It's it's what the entire music industry as it is today. Mainly, a lot of the people that are you know famous, and we talked about this earlier a little bit. A lot of people that are famous, you know what I'm saying? They they troll ninety percent, eighty 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 to eighty five percent of the time. That are like celebrity famous when they come to music. They troll. Even your boy. Who? Lil Uzi Vert. Yeah, but like he, at least he, he does it in a, he, the, okay, and if we're gonna talk about or bring somebody up in this, I guess the guidelines would be, let's look at their history of it since they've been famous. Mm -hmm. He hasn't done nothing where it's just like, okay. He's always done innocent stuff where it's just like, took That's it out of fact. context. That's a fact. Like, That's a fact. From what I take from him is like he's a cool like and I feel like nobody messed with him because it's just like this dude is like I don't know in a weird way I look at him like Peter Pan in the rap game but not like on some weird shit like I look at him like, <laughs> you feel me it's like a, a, a guy getting older but trying to, but staying young through the music like that's how I look at him like and he just displays that in a personality it was just like he got to the point where he made so much money where it's just like now I can do everything I used to want to do as a kid. Mm, true. And that's probably where you're at with this money right now. And I feel like most people go through that phase like when they get rich. like Especially at an early age. Like he's my age, bro. He's my, No, he's he's a year older than me. Yeah. I got a pedagogy. I'm old. 
I got I definitely got a Well, I'm old there. But, but I, I got believe, if I'm not wrong, wrong, he got like rich when he was 21. Oh yeah, nah, see. Yeah. Nigga struck. And we talk about that 25 thing, you feel me? Like you haven't even reached the point where your brain is able to like. Yeah, you don't really fully develop adult. until you're yeah, until you're twenty five as an adult, you don't really see what's out in that world until then. You can understand and start to see things I hope and I maybe I don't know fully because I don't know because I'm not there, but you feel me? And you start to see things I guess in a different manner and you're able to make responsible decisions like that. So now it's really up to you where it's like, okay, you fucking up, like you really but at the same time like certain things being young you should know like you know things. That are gonna, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, are, that will fuck me up and I probably shouldn't be doing it. But then again, that goes to how somebody's raised. That goes to if they're pri- privileged or not. Because if they're privileged, whatever they do is right. So probably. that thought of that thought of never that thought of never feeling um, or that thought of well this could fuck me up will never initially cross their head because I do what I want. I do, it's my birthday, have a fly a phone. You know what I'm saying? So. Good pose me. <laughs> she closed that door fast. Uh-huh. Yeah, supposedly. Um, we don't know, we can only assume because we're privileged. <laughs> Facts. Never privileged. Everything so, uh, we have that works, but then I feel still even being black, it none of that stuff would even matter, even if I had the money mm-hmm. and all of that. It would still come down to the fact that I'm black. What all of this? So it seems super no, suspicious. I say it would come down to your personality when you're black. If you're somebody that can assimilate to what they want, then. I don't think it'll be as well. No, it still be bad, but it won't be as bad. So yeah, you're right, black. <laughs> you're right, black. Because even the people that assimilate still get they they get honestly they might get the worst of it because they think they cool with white person or the person of other color that's not black. They think they cool. They think they're cool enough with that person to say whatever they want around them, and they won't feel no type of way. They get to tell they jokes. And you know that's crazy. You know what's crazy? Leading into that, like, I'm, I've, I've experienced so many, like, younger me, I feel like I would have a different reaction to seeing some stuff like that. Like, I would mm-hmm. probably be like, oh, oh, I'm finna, like, you feel me? I'm finna, like, I'm finna smack your ass, or I'm finna, like, you feel me? Like, you finna get, like, you about to get knocked out or something, like, yeah. But as I started to get older, I realized, like, I'm just gonna chill, like, let that, if that's how you assume eventually, you feel me? You're gonna say that around the wrong person. Like, I'm definitely the wrong person, but I've grown. Like, so it's just like. I let, you let it roll off your shoulder. That's yeah. the, in, the, in the sense, you let it roll off your the shoulder. The more you do that, the more you're setting yourself up. But at, in certain situations, I'm not saying like that you should do that completely. Like, you should definitely stand for what you believe in. But something as simple as that as you grow older, I realize that. If I do that, I just look as like the the uh, I look like the uh, the uh, what do you call that? The damn, uh, <laughs> uh, I look like the stereotype. Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. You look yeah. like exactly what they want you to look like. Yeah. I look oh, like- but piggyback. Sorry. Uh, this is just a fun fact. Fun fact. Did you know that mindset that you have is based off of? It's based off of a um, philosophy.